Technical Training Professionals is a company that uses detailed 3D models and animations to create clear instructions for maintenance procedures. To assemble the bearing, the inner leveling plates are placed in position first. Then the upper level plates rest between the inner leveling plates. Plate set screws will keep the upper leveling plates in position to ease assembly. The lower halves are placed on the shaft and with the base ring in position, the thrust pads are slid into position. This assembled section is now rolled into position. Before showing the details of a maintenance procedure, TTP content also explains system or component design and function. The PM valves each regulate gas flow to four independent headers, each of which will supply an associated PM nozzle or nozzles at each can. During startup, after the start sequence is complete with the purge cycle, the machine will ramp down to 475 RPM and back to firing speed of 505 RPM. By first showing location, use, and design of a component, the person performing the maintenance procedure gets a clear background of component function and integration with system operation. Lift oil is piped to the dead bottom center of all four bearings to provide a film of oil and lift the entire rotor. With a wedge of oil in between the shaft and bearings, the turning gear can turn the shaft. Before the start of maintenance activity, safety concerns can be clearly explained and potential accidents shown to drive home the importance of following clearance, protective clothing, and other safety items. A list of proper tools, rigging, and selection of other support equipment can be shown and illustrated. Once the action of removing the circuit breaker is started, it must not be stopped until the handle reaches, at a minimum, the test position. If the removal of the circuit breaker is stopped mid-travel, it can cause arcing in the gear and damage the circuit breaker or switch gear and result in a catastrophic arc flash event. Refer to plant arc blast policies and posted arc flash labels for proper PPE during the rackout event. By providing comprehensive maintenance procedures, technicians or trainees can understand and be aware of proper techniques to avoid errors or mistakes which can lead to costly extended or forced outages. For disassembly or reassembly, our content can provide step-by-step -step procedures to include the recording of applicable data, any parameters, and limits for any calibration requirements. To disassemble the oil reservoir, remove the level scale, followed by the retaining ring. Insert two 6-32nd screws onto the reservoir cover and pull it out. Remove the spring. TTP maintenance procedures can provide navigation to any specific step of a procedure. Links to vendor manuals, photos of failures, troubleshooting charts, and videos of actual procedure performance in the field. Contact TTP for cost estimates to create maintenance procedures on items ranging from valve actuators and pump maintenance to calibration and repair of instrumentation.